big boost in northern Kentucky. You're looking live at the newly renovated Turfway Park Racing and Gaming. And folks, that is where Governor Andy Bashir is expected to speak any minute now. The Turfway Park renovation costs $145 million, and they're not done yet. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Tanya O'Rourke. And I'm Craig McKee. The updated entertainment venue will combine live horse racing and historical horse racing terminals, which are, of course, very similar to slot machines. WCPO 9 News reporter Whitney Miller got a sneak peek ahead of tonight's soft opening. Things here at Turfway Park Racing and Gaming are looking very different. It's not just that live racing folks are used to. Now there are more ways to play, and it's bringing big competition to the Tri-State. Out with the old and in with the new. So this was a brand new winter circle that they're putting in right now. In less than 48 hours, Turfway Park Racing and Gaming will officially be open for business. The new $145 million facility offers state-of-the-art live thoroughbred racing along with 850 historical racing machines. The machines look and sound like what you find in a casino, but winnings are determined by chance based on data from past races and horses. They're very competitive for people that are seeking that type of entertainment out. The new venue offers a sports bar, VIP gaming area and lounge, a simulcast room and a clubhouse that will also be used as an event center. And get this, there are already some big events and weddings scheduled to use the space. We're going to be able to keep Kentucky money in Kentucky. We're going to give them, I think, hopefully a better experience than they'd find anywhere else. Turfway Park will be open seven days a week, nearly 24 hours a day. A move general manager Chip Box says will boost the local economy. Boone County is growing by leaps and bounds, and so is Florence, and as is the rest of northern Kentucky. He says that growth doesn't overshadow the beautiful legacy of Turfway Park. Each of our team members in orientation, they own a stake of being a steward of Turfway Park. From the beginning uh, in 1883 when they built Latonia till today, it's just going to be different, uh, but it's still going to create great memories for families. In Florence, Whitney Miller, WCPO 9 News.